Hello, and welcome to Sideshow's First Look. Today, we're looking at the Gambit Deluxe Six Scale Figure by Sideshow. Let's take a look. Now, this is a traditional shoe box. When we lift up, the upper and lower tray are held together by a band showing Gambit and some of the original artwork. Now, let's take a moment to focus on the artwork that goes around the figure box. Now, on the back of the box is a reproduction of the 1993 first series Marvel Gambit comic, complete with the Marvel logo up top. Now, around the box on both the exterior and interior are panels from throughout the comic. And this, as I said, goes completely around all sides of the box that hold the figure. Now you have two trays. In the upper tray is the figure, the swap out hair portrait, the triple card throwing effect, the single card, four individual playing cards. On the lower tray, the staff figure stand, and 14 additional hands. Everything laid out in front of you. You're gonna have your figure, four playing cards, the ace of spades magic card, the triple throwing effect, his staff, those 14 additional hands, the swap out hair portrait, and the figure stand. Let's take a moment to look at each one of these up close. The first accessory up is going to be this triple card throwing effect. Now the cards that you have, you're going to insert into the three places right there, and right here, it will attach on to one of the glowing hands. This is a translucent piece, allowing the light to go through. Our Ace of Spades glowing effect, translucent, allowing the light to go through. The card is permanently attached, but it will fit into multiple versions of the hands that are supplied. Now you have four individual aces, one for each suit. They are a double-sided, and you can choose how to use them in many of the hands provided. And an impressive 13 and one half inch die cast metal staff for the figure. Now here is the swap out hair sculpt. The part that hangs down is a softer pliable material. Great detail. And then it presses right down into the head for the swap out portrait. Now there are four sets of see-through energy wielding hands. The first up is the fists. They are going to be that energy and then that skin color fading in on all of these. The second on those see-through hands are going to be for holding the staff. Next up is going to be the two-finger point that also holds the individual cards. Here's that energy-wielding hand holding one of the individual cards. You can see how translucent they are and how the light comes through. Lastly are going to be these ones with kind of a splayed out hand gesture. And these fingers are what you will attach the three card throwing effect to. Now here's that translucent three card throwing effect. It is attached to the special hand as well as we've inserted the three cards to it. The light goes through that very easily. We have gripping hands for use with the staff and the leather fingerless gloves. We have the two finger point hand that also you can attach the cards to. Here's that card inserted into one of the hands with the non-energy effect. And then we have our gesturing open splayed hand in the non-energy look. A traditional hexagonal display base. First up is our Gambit portrait. Now this is with the hair wild and up. We've got that very determined smirk, the bright eyes with the hint of magic. This is with that unique kind of cowl that he wore. You can see some incredible texture done in the hair. Now this Gambit figure deluxe does have two swap out hair pieces. They are magnetic. They lift right off. There's your magnet in the center. I'm gonna swap out the hair and show you the other one right now. Here is that alternate hairstyle. This is with the longer over the ear, the wisp of hair down in front over the headband. We then move down onto the outfit. Now on the outside, we're going to have a cloth trench coat with incredible detail down to the little tiny buttons, little metal clasps. Those clasps are also gonna be on the wrists here. 
You have the epaulets also have little tiny buttons, and nice tight stitching. The inside is all gonna be done in a glossy paisley. And this reveals that chest armor in that bright purple and then the metallic lines going all about. Now he does have that tight undersuit in the black that goes down here onto the leg. That purple color of the chest armor now goes down onto the leg, onto the side. We get that metallic color again into the boot. The bottom of the shoe, complete with X-Men logo. Now let's show all the articulation points. Articulation for the head, you're gonna be able to fully turn. You also have the neck can lean forward and back and downward as well. You're gonna have that cloth underneath and then the sculpted head. Talk about the arm, we're able to go straight out we go straight out front as well. It's going to be a double joint for the elbow, traditional wrist peg. Now, because of the armor on the chest, we're not gonna have any articulation points here underneath the armor. The ability to turn and twist is all going to be done down here in the waist. I'm gonna move the jacket out of the way so we can see that. But you do have a great amount of turn on either side and a great amount of tilt as well. Now down to the hip joints. Because this is a soft fabric used on the legs, it does not bunch or have to worry about a tear or stressing the material there. You're able to go fully out to the side. You will feel a ratchet style there. Forward, straight out. knee will go a little more than 90. Now the ankle here, you have that boot coming down. It is a cut boot here, so you are going to get rock back and forth and the ability to go up and down as well. Now the entire leg does have the ability to twist from side to side, as does the arm in the bicep, a twist from side to side as well. Let's take him and put him in a few poses. This has been Sideshow's first look at the Gambit Deluxe six scale figure by Sideshow. For more information about this figure, follow the link below. And be sure to join us on Unsealed and Revealed, where we take this figure through a gambit of poses. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to let your geek side show.